Hello and welcome to this channel about cryptocurrency education. Today we're talking about VentUp. Um, I'm very excited because VentUp or Vent is planning their own IDO, which is a decentralized coin offering. And that will happen already um, yeah, in a few weeks and you can register from, I believe, the 7th of July and we're getting to that. But it means that you have a chance to get some of these coins in a decentralized coin offering and the special thing is that it is Cardano based and they have made the conscious decision to choose Cardano as platform and we'll get into that. So let's quickly talk about what Vent or VentUp is and then we're talking about the IDO and how you can register and um, then we'll we'll take it from there. Okay, so if you're interested in that, stick with me. By the way, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. So you should always do your own research before making any investment decisions. So. This article here is from April and I'm not gonna talk about it very long, but just to make you aware that this has been going on um, for a while and they had this project went up. They raised $100,000 at the time in pre-seed funding. So you can already see that there is something behind it. Um, there were people funding that project and this was already done, uh, all done in a decentralized way as well. But that was back in April since then a few things happened what they've done actually today yeah on their twitter channel here um they have announced that they have announced the upcoming registration of the ido but before we talk about that let's have a quick look at the vent um website so vent up is a platform that is based on or running on cardano and I mentioned it already, but it is an IDO launchpad for high growth potential projects. So what is IDO? IDO is a decentralized coin offering, you could say. So it's similar to an ICO, but also different because ICO is, it's an initial coin offering, but it normally runs on a centralized ex exchange. Whereas IDO is supposed to be a new and innovative way in the crypto world to um, get funding for crypto projects. So it's all decentralized peer to peer and you cut the middleman out. That's pretty much what it is. It has a lot of advantages because it's completely decentralized and um, you know it's, it's, it's basically all done by the community in a very, very um, transparent way. So this project here, Vent, um, Vent basically contains of Vent Up, which is the actual launch pad. So on that, that is a launch pad running on Cardano, on the Cardano blockchain and different um, yeah, people, groups, organizations, whatever, they can, launch their own project or cryptocurrency on um, the VentUp launchpad and gain funding in a decentralized way, right? So that is one way. And the other one is VentSwap, where you can just swap um, your cryptocurrency with other cryptos in a decentralized way. For example, you could swap ETH with um, the Binance coin, for example, yeah? Um, they call it IDO, a IDO launchpad for game changes where they relate to yeah basically innovative projects don't they and then they talk this is basically their they call it light paper uh, so just a summary of actually what they're doing you can see here these are the features that they um want to you know introduce on their vent up um, launch pad so there will be a detailed project profile for new projects project ratings yeah know your customer is very important there's a whitelisting process anti-scam features, so that's what they focus about. They take a lot of focus on the community, so I guess that's why they put it in the center here. There will be forums, a chat, I really like that chat functionality. Um, yeah, votes, comments, reviews, really good. They focus a lot on the community, which I think is very important, especially when you talk about a decentralized launchpad. And then, yeah, because it's a decentralized platform, you have cross-chain swaps as well, which is great, liquidity pools, wallet integration as well and permissionless listings, which um, makes use of the decentralized um, yeah, uh, possibilities. Now here, what you can see DeFi space. So this is why they focused on Cardano. Um, you know, they, they compare Cardano here to Polkadot and Ethereum. They say Polkadot has decent, uh, very centralized governments, but it has high growth potential products, but again, limited power chains, which they say is negative because it is quite limited in terms of that. I think that hasn't changed. What has changed actually, to my knowledge, I might be wrong, to my knowledge, I don't think it's centralized anymore, Polkadot, but you can correct me. Um, I didn't do much research now about this, but to my knowledge, um, that was changed, that centralized governance, but I, I might be wrong. 
as we know with Ethereum, yeah, it is quite slow, it's quite expensive. And then Cardano, you've got the engaged community, which is very important when you're talking about a decentralized um, launchpad um, for yeah, IDOs, basically. So if without a community, you probably couldn't run or launch such a, uh, a launchpad itself, because if you don't have the community backing it, nobody would be interested in um, yeah, using it. And that's the whole point of a decentralized um, IDO launchpad. Fast transactions, scalable, easy to launch, security built in. Yeah, all of that we know about. And all of these are certainly strength of the Cardano platform. Um, let's have a quick look at the roadmap. So we're currently here, Q2. I think it's a bit after Q2, isn't it? But um, if that will happen in July, but that is the event token sale that will happen and uh, MVP launch. And then Q3, this is where they do the migration to Cardano, which is great, which is when Hopefully the Alonso test phase or the Alonso phase will be over and the smart contracts will be launched on the Cardano blockchain. That'd be good. And then uh, yeah, Q4, a few things happening then, but we are focusing here on the Vent token sale. That will be a great um, opportunity. Now this is about the team, really good team, people with a lot of experience in um, cryptocurrencies and blockchain and coming from different countries here but it all is very transparent. I really like all of that. And um, they already had a lot of demand here. First of all, media requests, already project IDO requests. Yeah, so many people are interested in running, launching their own project. And then also there's a pre-sale over subscription. But then, yeah, they they talked about the um, launching their own, um, the, the IDO of the event coin. So, they say the Vent Finance is excited to announce that the registration for the Vent IDO on the Vent Hub Launchpad will open on Wednesday, the July the 7th. So you should focus on, uh, check their Twitter out, yeah, because you can start to register on the 7th of July if you're interested in grabbing some of these Vent coins. That's how I understand it. There will be a whitelist lottery as well. So you need to apply between the 7th and the 14th of July. So that obviously gives you the chance to grab some of these coins for a very low price, because um, historically it's always it's generally the case that these coins, if you get them in sort of a IDO or even ICO, they normally, you get them for a quite a good price and then they normally go up in value straight after that because the, um, yeah, the quantities are normally limited in these IDOs or ICOs. So that is what you can do. And that is what is really exciting and interesting. Um, what they also say, and that is quite good, um, I'll just see if I can find that. So here it is. So they say there will be two rounds. Yeah, in the first round, they will be giving a guaranteed allocation to whitelisted participants that have successfully passed KYC. So if you pass the Know Your Customer process, um, you get a guaranteed allocation. So that will be interesting. And uh, round two is then about uh, first come, first serve yeah based on the allocation that remains so that is very interesting and then the exact date and the details of the ido for the vent token will be announced for the day the whitelist lottery closes so it's a very exciting very very exciting um ido here first of all ido is very innovative it's something new um there haven't been that many compared to icos and then the vent this process or project i think it's very interesting in itself because it runs on cardano and a lot of is happening on cardano anyway and then the, uh, first of all, that IDOs are getting more popular and this project itself is a launchpad for IDOs. So I think this is innovation in its finest form and you can grab these coins, which is even better. There are other um, IDO platforms for Cardano. One of them is this one here, Oc um, sorry, I think it's quite Occam, O-C-C-A-M. Um, so this is also one platform that plans to offer IDOs. Um, but yeah, basically that's all I wanted to talk about. Let me know what you think about Vent. I think it's very exciting. And also to grab a, um, a coin for a good price in such an IDO is a good opportunity for everybody. So yeah, hopefully this, you found some value in this. If you did, then please smash the like button and please, please, please support the channel by subscribing because it's still a small channel growing every day. But uh, the channel needs every support it can get. So thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.